What's going on, everybody? It's Edward Davis from Checkmate Sports, and welcome to Sports Agent Secrets. In this episode, we are going to talk about the death of sports agents. Now, you're probably scared. You're probably wondering, what is that about? And to be honest, you should be. That money clip us now, the new now looks like Whoa, upgrade her diamonds now, her girlfriends are like Whoa, 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 whoa What's going on, everybody? It's Edward Davis from Checkmate Sports, and today's episode is sponsored by, guess who? Checkmate Sports. If you want to become a professional sports agent in as little as 30 days without going to law school, without inside connections, and without some difficult certification exam, then the Sports Agent Masterclass is for you. Click the link below under this video and sign up now. Take care. In November 2020, I was the first person to tell people about the name, image and likeness bill that was going to be passed in 2021 that would allow student athletes to get paid. And that would basically become the next gold rush where people overnight will basically become professional sports agents And here in 2022. I'm going to be the first person to say this, that now I'm calling it the death of sports agents. And the reason why I say that is because in my program, we're helping 20 to 30 people become professional sports agents every single month. And they're seeing success. They're getting clients. They're closing deals. I mean, it's life changing. But what I'm noticing is and, you know, you, you guys know, you know, I, I shoot you straight. There's always going to be people who try to cut corners. There's always going to be people who say, hey, I don't need help. I could do it alone. And I, and and to be honest, I was one of those individuals. I was one of those. I, 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 I'm going to go through, you know, YouTube University. I'm, I'm going to go to the school of hard knocks. <laughs> but the problem with that is you, you, you waste time, you waste money and, you know, you embarrass yourself. There's a lot of people who are, you know, getting into the, the industry and becoming sports agents and they're not making any money. They're they're doing a disservice to their clients because they're getting clients uh, because they're telling them that they're sports agents and they don't know how to secure deals. They don't know how to market their clients. And it's really doing a disservice to the industry as a whole because it's get it's painting agents in a bad light. And just to be honest, agents already have a bad stigma. And now when you get guys who men and women who don't really know what they're doing. It's going to, you know, bring the, the industry down as a whole um, on the brighter side. And, and what I can can say is the agents who do know what they're doing, they're going to get even richer. Now, if you check the Forbes list, you know, the top agents in this in our industry are making between 20 to 100 million per year, not for their whole career per calendar year. So it's a bunch of money in this industry and it's going to get even bigger with student athletes now being able to get paid so the bigger agents we're going to continue to you know thrive but the, the, what i've noticed is that a lot of the agents that are coming into the space that they're they're not going to be able to make it out of year one and year two and i wanted to do this episode so that you don't be that you know be like them and um the first thing i noticed that uh agents are struggling with is they don't understand the importance of credibility that's the end all be all, I think, in our profession, because a lot of times we get so caught up in, you know, name dropping somebody or, or or saying, hey, I got this credential or I went to this law school. And at the end of the day, nobody cares. Nobody cares about, you know, uh, your, your credentials. They care about two things. Can they trust you and can you get the job done? That's all that matters. If you can show people that you are trustworthy and that you can get the job done, that's where the conversation begins. People skip that. They're so such in such a rush to get a credential or get something behind their name or get, you know, some piece of paper to put on the wall. And then they rush into the industry and then they get blindsided and it doesn't end well. I know a lot of moms, a lot of dads, a lot of brothers, a lot of teachers, a lot of pastors, a lot of youth coaches who want to become sports agents. And they they don't realize that they think, oh, because I coach this guy or because this is my daughter, I'm going to become an agent. And then they're going to, you know, 
let me represent them. And in theory, it sounds good, but you have to think about it. These, this, you know, this is their, their one shot to, to, to make it, you know, they have millions of dollars on the line. And if you are a teacher, bus driver, you know, real estate developer, something like this, and then overnight you become an agent, with no, you know, prior preparation, no prior training, you're, you're doing a disservice to them and, you know, they're not going to take you serious. And just and just just think about it for a second. Just imagine if you, you know, you did get the top 10 draft pick and they say, hey, I do want to sign with you and you end up, you know, representing them. Do you think that you would be able to do a good job for them? Chances are no. Why? Because you don't have any proper training. That's why we created the Sports Agent Accelerator Program to help people learn the information and the skill set that they need so that if they do get the opportunity that they can excel. Now, I want you all to understand that because a lot of times when I tell people that they need to invest in a mentorship program or, 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 or some type of um, coaching program, they, you know, they, they want to they want to be cheap. You know, they want to, ah, you know, I, I'm, I'm a learn by trial and error. But the problem with that is, you know, you're risking, um, you know, burning that relationship because what you don't want to do is you don't want to fumble the bag and cost somebody, you know, millions of dollars because you didn't have your paperwork right or because you, you know, didn't do what you were supposed to do. Um, uh, I had an individual uh, who went through our, our program. A client's name was uh, Showtime Arnett, and uh, he was a sports broadcaster in Indianapolis. And he was working in the industry for years. He grew up a ball boy for the for the uh, Pacers and just always been in the industry. But he, you know, didn't know that he could become a sports agent uh, without going to law school. He heard about our program. I remember he left a comment on my ad said it was fake. It, it, it wasn't real. Instead of, you know, calling him out, you know, cussing him out, I said, you know what? I, I sent him a DM. Just wanted to see what was going on with the brother. We had a conversation. I said, hey, man, you go through our program. I'm going to prove that it's legit. Um, he ended up going through our program. Within 20 days, we was able to get him his sports agent license without law school. I mean, he was pumped up. I mean, cried tears of joy. But what, what happened next is the important part. Um, he assumed because now that he had a sports agent license that he was going to be able to get any type of client that he wanted. But the problem is everybody saw him as a sports commentator, not as a sports agent. So it was hard in the beginning for him to get clients. But after going through our program and we show him how to checkmate market himself, meaning to show, you know, that he was trustworthy, that he was credible. He was able to get clients reaching out to him. And within three weeks of working with us, he was able to secu to secure two NBA draft prospects. And that's what this program is all about. And that's why, you know, um, I wanted to to, you know, to touch on this topic, because I I think that um, if the industry as a whole doesn't understand the importance of of credibility and learning this information, the industry, the, 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 the profession as a whole is, is, is not going to last. So whether you work with us or you, or, or not, I just want to stress the importance of you, um, taking this craft serious. Um, you have to invest in yourself, whether going through us, whether, you know, uh, going to college, going to law school, you have to learn this information because you're doing a disservice to the clients. These guys, Guys are practicing every day. They got more, they got uh, they got morning workouts. They got classwork. They got study hall. They got practice. They don't have time to do this information, you know, to practice and study all this. That's why they need individuals like us, the agents, financial advisors, the trainers, to be able to be that you know source of of information for them. So. The whole point is I don't want to make this some long video, but I just want you all to understand that if you're coming into the space, you have to invest in yourself. If you t if you cut in corners, if you're trying to be cheap, I want you to understand this isn't the industry for you. OK, there's you know, you got NFTs, you got, you know, crypto, you got all those things. You can go and cut corners and do all those things. But if you want to become a sports agent and you want to hit the twenty hundred million dollar mark, if you want to represent, you know, first round, second round athletes, 
You have to invest in yourself. And that's what we do at the Checkmate Sports Agent Accelerator Program. So if you want to, you know, take come into this industry, if you want to become an agent and you want to get to the next le level and be successful, then click the link below. Sign up for our program and I'll see you on the other side. Take care. What's going on, everybody? It's Edward Davis from Checkmate Sports. I just want to let you guys know that we launched the first ever sports agent themed merchandise store. So if you want to get a shirt like this that says Sports Agent Matter, we have shirts, phone cases, uh, cups. We have everything that you could want to become a sports agent. If that's something that interests you, click the link below, go into our merch shop, and I'll see you over there. All right, take care.